Guys, good morning. Here's what we're rocking with today. We're crushing it with the turf tracer. We're crushing it with the X Mark, the Z, and it is a hot and steamy Wednesday. Hope you guys are doing well. Quick uh, little update on the turf tracer. We're going to be rocking it again today. Something different. Uh, this is the demo unit that X Mark dropped off to us just to shoot some quick videos for you guys and maybe help some of you that might be in the market. Absolutely awesome mower. You guys might have seen the video we did a couple weeks ago, but. We're gonna jump onto it, man. We're gonna get mowing here today. Six miles an hour. Let's go take it into the field. Let's go cut some grass. Let's see how we do.
too bad. <laughs> All right, guys. Hope you guys are doing well. Uh, it is. What is it right now? Wednesday morning. I think so. It's Wednesday morning. We're crushing it just like you guys are. Uh, we're rocking the X Mark Turf Tracer. We're doing a little, little quick video here for X Mark with these guys. We changed the deck height. Last time we did it, uh, it was a little soft. Some of you guys pointed that out. We might be mowing at four inches, so we dropped it down to three. Uh, it's gonna be what 90 degrees today, Connor. And yeah. We got Connor behind the camera. Another day, another today. nickel from Brian's lawn maintenance. No, we give you. We're, we're we're fair here. We give you 25 cents bump per hour. If it's over 90, that'd be actually a pretty cool yeah. pay, pay, be. pay yeah. structure. Yeah. The hotter it is, the more you get paid. Yeah. Hey, come like work with that. us. 100 degrees today. All right. Well, you get 30 dollars an hour. <laughs> uh, Rob's over here blowing, finishing up. Some. Hey, really quick, uh, before we jump too far into the video, some of you guys wanted a shout out from the last video. Now, I don't normally do shout outs because, well, honestly, if I do one, then 50 more people ask, so it just kind of gets awkward and I can't shout out everybody every video, but uh, we have shout out to TJS Landscaping. You want a quick shout out? And then Thomas McCowan or McEwen? I don't know how to say your last name, brother, sorry, but these are some of the comments from last week or last couple of vlogs. So if you guys have some funny comment or you guys want a shout out, I don't know, leave me a comment down below. I'll help you guys out. Uh, what else are we gonna be talking about today? Oh, some of you guys wanted a quick little laser Z update. Well, while well, Rob's blowing, we can do this. Uh, Matt, 4545, let's let, get a laser Z hour update. Uh, kind of swing around for me if you don't mind. Yep. Let's see. And then we actually gotta get to work today, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, where are we at on the hours? Um, 973, dang, I thought it was eight something. Yeah, is it showing up on the camera, yeah. hopefully? Uh, 973.6, wow. I didn't wow. know we would have a thousand hours on this thing. Dang, That's, Rob's been uh, killing it on that. Dude, I never would have thought. I, I, we were at six or 700 like two minutes ago. That actually just kind of like hit me. I'm like, wow, so a thousand hours already on the Z. Well, 1500 is usually when I trade them in, so we gotta think about that. But honestly, I don't think we've had to do any real maintenance on this unit. Um, it's been, a stout little setup. We got the Kohler Big Block, the Red Tech. I talked about the track this last Thursday or Friday, but that was an hour update. There you go. Actually, here, come over here. This is right here what we do. So 621, we put them on the hour meter around the oil. So it was at 937. So we're due for an oil change, like big time. It's been about six weeks here. So, all right. Well, there's a quick little laser Z update for Matt 4545. Well, here, while we're at it, if you guys want a speed feed head, this is a speed feed 400. Line up the arrows with the eyelet. You'll see a little light come through. There it is. This one's kind of a... You can do it. Interesting one to do. Let's see. Which replacement heads do you have on your... Uh, uh, I, I usually ran the speed feeds. Uh, I just got a Red Max 260 TS or whatever it is. Yep. Right, guys, well, it's uh, 210. We're wrapping up the day. Rob, how we doing? Oh, good. Just, <laughs> you know, just giving people the wake up call. Of course, we got that on camera. My brother lives in that apartment complex, and so it's a company policy. Is it true? It's a true. Very. You don't yes. do it, you get fired. You don't do it, you get fired. It's a company policy. Every time we go by those apartments. I've already been fired three times. <laughs> you got to honk the horn. My brother and sister in law, they always text me. Me. They always go disturbing the peace, DTP. Is that ludicrous? So, really quick, Connor had a question back there, which was kind of talking about what is the ideal crew or rig if I was going to get bigger? Or what do you see around here working? Yeah, yeah. And, you know, it's pretty interesting. I'm sure you guys live in some different areas, but around here, uh, pretty much everyone uses 60 inch uh, laser Z, or not laser Z's, zero uh, turns. Zero turns. Walk uh, well, you do see a lot of laser Z's, but you'll, you'll see some other brands up here too. Um, but I know in other areas, you guys use some smaller mowers and you know, the price point to get into a big zero turn like that, you know, you gotta factor in the price of the zero turn and then the price of the trailer, the truck, to pay all the employees, all that stuff. And it's like, how do you work it out to where you're able to put these crews out here without going in an insane amount of debt and actually build the business and actually make money? Right. Um, so well, I, I was weighing in, I think, out of everybody I've seen so far, I love Corey Ballard's setup the most. Uh, maybe you guys can weigh in. I don't know where we're going on this whole topic, but I like Corey Ballard's setup, all commercial mowing, and then he's got Isuzu box trucks, or the Isuzus, right, the Rhinos, and then anything for snow, he uses the front end loaders, skid steers that they already have and they rent, and then push boxes. Yeah. It just seems so efficient, so productive. I mean, I've ever, you know, you can get 500 trucks and 500 plows, but that's a lot moving around, and then trailers are a lot moving around. Yeah. Because you were asking me, I'm like, if I was gonna get super big, I said, I, I love Corey Ballard's uh, 
business and equipment setup. Just yeah. it just seems so optimized and so efficient. Oh yeah. I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments, but. All right, well, we're wrapping up this vlog. We're pulling into our storage place. Rob, you doing good, bud? Doing good. We actually did pretty good today. We did all of our lawns, and then we actually did six extra ones to hopefully make Thursday a lighter day. Instead of getting done at 4.30, we'll be done at three o'clock. And that's what we got. Oh, we also did a great trimming vlog with you. So uh, your flip edge technique. So if you guys want to watch that, that'll hopefully be tomorrow's vlog or a day or two later. So that's what we got. All right, another little day in the life vlog. A lot of people have been enjoying the daily vlogs. It's a lot of work, a lot of editing, yeah, a lot of uh, running and, around. Uh, if, if you guys got tips. You can't make it, you can't make that. Okay. You, no, you won't be able to make that. <laughs> we got Sorry. a lot going on here. Yeah, but this guy's got to move. If you guys got uh, like, <laughs> tips for you know anything, how to flip edge or whatever, something that's kind of relevant, I mean, guys, put that stuff in the comment section because, you know, what you think is like, oh, I already know that, that's so simple, might be like, oh my God, I never thought of it that way to someone else. So like, nice. Yeah, that's leave some, good. Leave some comments. Leave also, it helps the YouTube algorithm. The YouTube algorithm, man. Oh, gotta go, gotta love it. <laughs> All right, man. Well, hey, appreciate you guys watching. And uh, Connor's the man. Rob's doing a great job for him. Rob carrying the team today too. And uh, we'll catch up with you guys in the next one. All right, bye.